everybody welcome back to my channel i just wanted to hop on check on everyone of course i wanted to attempt to go over a pre-budget for the second budget by paycheck for the month of november so i'm doing something a little different of course i don't know what my income would be for my first paycheck but i went through and just checked to see what's the lowest i've made and as of right now it's $1,317 and that's based on the lowest paycheck from September and when it comes to the leftovers the minimum amount that I may end up with is $40 for health I do need to pay a copay before having my surgery next week on the 20th and that amount is $719.50 which will be coming from my health savings account and for the total income it equals up to $2,076.50 if you are new to my channel welcome and if you haven't already hit that red subscribe button and that notification bell go ahead and do the so that way you would be notified anytime i upload a new video i'm currently in the process of eating my lunch which is just seasoned broccoli and the season is black pepper and fiesta ranch dressing season it's pretty good and yeah i'm really not sure why i'm in the end up eating just broccoli for lunch it's kind of weird but we're gonna go with it and move on so when it comes to the rent let me fix this here when it comes to the rent we're going to go ahead and get the other half of the 725 dollars which is 365 when it comes to state form and that's car insurance life insurance renters insurance it's 141 but when you round it up it's 142 um, the copay for the surgery is seven hundred nineteen dollars and fifty cents when the lady called me and told me that amount I was like what and it's crazy because I have that amount. I have it in my health savings account. I also have it in my emergency fund. And it's crazy that I don't want to give up such a... It's not a large amount of money, but it's a large amount of money to me. And I don't want to give it away. But I got to do what I got to do. When it comes to Black Friday, I am budgeting for 200 And hopefully, I don't have anything that go over that amount. For Thanksgiving, I am budgeting for $100. That amount may end up being a little less since I'm not sure if I'll be able to drive after surgery. Well, not after surgery, but a couple days after surgery. I won't know if I'll be able to drive on Thanksgiving Day, which is to go to my mom's house and sister's house, which is about three and a half hours away or three hours depending on how fast you drive and yeah I can get there in a good amount of time for emergency fund I wanted to save 200 this time but I'm just going to go with a hundred for gifts I am going to save the regular amount which is sixty dollars and for Starbucks don't really know how much or if I even budget for Starbucks, but we're going to do $10 just in case. When it comes to cash envelopes. So when it comes to food, I'm just going to budget for $150. And I may end up not spending that amount because I've noticed that I've been eating less my boyfriend he's been pretty much eating less and we don't really have to spend such a large amount on food anymore but we want to kind of play it safe and have a good amount just in case when it comes to the washer I am going to budget for ten dollars which I don't think we'll end up going to the washer this next week but we'll see 
when it comes to gas for the car I am going to budget for $30 and when it comes to our share I am going to do $60 not necessarily meaning that this amount will get used but just in case for travel now this is not for vacation fun or things like that but it is for if I decide and feel like driving home so this would be for gas for snacks on the go things like that when you add everything up it does equal up to $2,469.50 and if you subtract that amount from the income at the top which is $2,076.50 you would end up with $30 now if I do end up with $30 what I'm going to do is put that amount back into one of my checking accounts and it will either act as a buffer or it will just stay there until I make sure all of the bills are paid and then I'll move it to my savings account. So I do hope everyone have a great rest of your night. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And yeah, I'm not really sure if this will be my last video before surgery or not since it is on the 20th. I will try to make or attempt to make two more videos before surgery so hopefully I would be able to do so talk to you guys later